Not the smoke in the air nor a feeling of sickness can stop Missoula Big Sky quarterback Levi Janicaro, who picked up right where he left off from last season and then some. Putting up four Benjamins to start the season already has a senior signal caller on top of Class AA football and is our Athlete of the Week. To be able to, to, be able to do something like that and, and total yards too, I mean those aren't, those aren't low numbers. So uh, kind of set a standard there with those marks. In Big Sky's season opener against Billings West, Eagles quarterback Levi Janicaro wasted no time displaying his brilliance on the football field. After punishing opposing defenders his junior season, Janicaro ran all over the Gold Bears defense in his team's 33-25 victory Friday night to the tune of 285 yards rushing and 400 yards of total offense, both setting school records. I mean, it, it uh, means a lot, but I, I can't really like focus on that and get caught up in, in, in it. You know, it's not really me that's getting the yards. It's because of my line. You know, they're, they're, they're the ones that are paving the way. His performance was super gutty. Um, he didn't feel good. And to put up those kind of numbers, I mean, and Billings West is no slouch. They were a pretty good football team. And we just happened to catch them right and, uh, you know, Levi, Levi just went off shift there for a while. While 400 total yards has never been touched in Big Sky history, this isn't the first time Janet Carroll has gone off. He rushed for more than 200 yards twice last season and averaged 156 yards of rushing per game. But like number 15 says, he won't allow himself to get caught up in the numbers, especially since the Sentinel Spartans are driving across town and visiting the Eagle's Nest this week. I'm excited, you know, I mean, it's Crosstown, Sentinel, you know, it's not to love about that. It's not to get excited about. They're a good team, and if we can come out and beat them, then going 2-0 and is huge, and then we have CMR, and they're going to be a decent team too, but 2-0, and you have a bunch of confidence, and going into that third week, it'd be huge. We had to wait nine days into September before we got Crosstown football last year. Now it's only two. Sentinel Big Sky Friday night at 7.30. History lesson. Janet Carroll went for a buck 80 and three scores all on the ground as the Eagles were victorious 26-20 in the only Crosstown game last season.